Oh, bro, can, nice. Look at that. Okay, okay. I, I, if you guys want chief football jerseys, make sure to check out GRFC. Link in the description. Yo, guys, welcome back to our video. So today, we're going to be reacting to this player right here. His name goes by Wilmore Barrios. I think his name is the Colombian defensive mid. I'm pretty sure he is. So big, big shout out to the person that told me to react to this guy. Apparently, he's the Colombian Kante. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be reacting to him and see how he is. Um, and uh, yeah, but before we get into a video, make sure you guys like button, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new, which is 12k subs by the end of the year. So if you guys are new, please hit the subscribe button. Other than that, let's get straight into this reaction. Okay, bro, link to the original video in the description. Let's get this one started, bro. Let's get this one started. Um, defensive mid. Let's see how he is. Someone said he's the Colombian Kante. Um, let's see. Let's see, bro. Let's see. Okay, I can't see what's happening there. If anything happens on the bottom left screen, I can't see it because my camera's there. So if I don't commentate over it, it's because my camera's there. Nice. Okay, okay. So we're going to be seeing a lot of tackles. You could tackle. Ooh. That was a foul. Nice. Okay. Alright. Against Neymar. Nice. Okay. 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 I can see. I can see why people are comparing him to Kante. I can see why. I can see why playing for Zenit. I think I'm pretty sure as well now. Nice. Used to play for Boca. I think. Nice. He's got strength. This man. He does. No, no. no. This guy does have strength, bro. For Boca. Nice. Look at that. Okay. Okay. I, I, I can see. I can see the comparison now. You know what I mean? Because the thing is. When people say Kante, a lot of people just any defensive mid people compare him to Kante. But this guy actually does remind me a bit of Kante. I can see that Kante in him, you know. But uh, yeah, bro, nice to another tackle there, bro. Beautiful. Nice on him, bro. You see how he's on him? The whole time he was on him. They didn't let him breathe once, bro. Against Fred, there he's better than Fred. I'm not gonna lie, he is better than Fred. I'm a, I'm a not a fan. Hey. Bring this man because we need a DM and a new manager as well. So if Zenit or Colombia have a manager, bring them through as well. Bro. Bring them through because we need both of them. Nice. But uh, yeah, I can see but this guy like moved to like a Syria, a Syria team, you know, um, Inter, something like that. I can see him playing for, for, for a solid big team, bro, in Syria, Bundesliga, maybe something like that. In the Premier League, I'd love to see him in the Premier League. But uh, yeah, man. Let me know in the comments down below um, what teams he's linked to in real life. Apologies for the bird noise in the background. Nice. Okay. Again, again. I don't really lo like reacting to defensive mid because or seeing tackles isn't that fun to watch. But um, or, uh, it's fun to watch, but it's kind of like... Um, it's not like seeing goals in that, like, so if I don't go crazy and over some skills, it's because he's just tackling, you know. But hopefully we see a few goals in them kind of stuff there, but yeah, and this video is called No One Can No One Can Get Past, No One Can Dribble Past Wilmore Berrius, and yeah, I haven't seen one person dribble past him, man. Good tackle. Nice. Oh, by defensive mid, this guy, man. He, 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 he's one of them players who just don't want to verse. Was I guess it's Chaya, I think? Look at that. You know what I like about him, bro? Do you see the way he's just sticking? He's sticking to them, bro. This is the play on the ball. This is him. He just sticks on them, bro. He's just on them, waiting for them to make a mistake. Pulls his legs through, wins the ball. There you go. I love that, man. I love that about him. And when he goes in, you just know he's getting the ball. He goes in at the right time. He knows what he's doing. He's not one of them players that goes in sometimes, fouls. I know it's highlights, but from what it looks like, man, he looks, he just, he's looking very, very good, bro. I'm not going to lie, he is. Nice, look at that. I, I told you, bro, on him, on him, on him, and then gets the ball. Look at that, beautiful. Beautiful slide. Another one. It's, it's, it's just no way like they actually like eight minutes of him just tackling people. Unbelievable, bro. Unbelievable. 
Look at that, nice. Slid a bit early there, but still ended up getting the ball. Nice, bro. This guy's like the midfield version of Wan Bissaka when it comes to tackling. Because Wan Bissaka is, is terrible at everything else, if we're going to be honest. Look at that, man. Comes out of nowhere, bro, as well. Nice. Uh, yeah, it's an unbelievable time. I don't know if I'm gonna watch this whole video because, um, yeah, I don't know if I am. We'll see, we'll see. No oh, tackle there. Nice. But yeah, um, if you guys want me to react to other plays as well, let me know in the comments down below, bro. Um, I'm gonna try to start reacting to games as well, but the thing is, it's hard because I have to wake up a bit early to react to games. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna try to start reacting to like Serie A games, Premier League, Bundesliga, La Liga, and PSG games. I was gonna say Liga, but only PSG games. And um, yeah, maybe other big games around the world, like uh, like rivals. I don't know, you know, some Portuguese games, Porto, Benfica, you know, things like that, sporting and that. So if you guys are into that, bro, hit the subscribe button. If you guys want to check out other plays as well, as usual. Let me know in the comments down below and I will most likely react to it. Come out, yeah. Good goalkeeping there. Okay. You know what I like about it? I don't know, maybe in real life he fouls more, uh, but we haven't really seen. Again, it is his highlight, so we don't know. Like, He might do this a lot in game and just foul a lot of plays instead of getting the ball, but um, I'm not sure. I'm not 100% sure there. But there's about like two minutes left, the video's about to end. But yeah, this guy, it, it, the thing is, bro, there's defensive mitts out there. And when you look at Declan Rice, he's worth 100 mil, bro. You have this man right here. If you go and get him, he's probably going to be worth around 20, 30 mil, if we're going to be honest. Max 40, bro. No more than 40. No more than 40. And he, and um, he could be as good as Rice. You know, Rice is worth 100 mil. And indeed, he's worth like... He would, if you want to go get Ndidi, you might be worth 90 mil. You can go and get this guy. So, um, if you're a Man United, Chelsea team like that, maybe look at this guy, bro. Maybe take the risk. Um, yeah, bro, maybe take the risk on him. Or maybe if uh, West Ham loses a Declan Rice, go and get him to replace him. Uh, but yeah, he's one of them plays, bro, where I'm not, he's kind of hidden, bro. I didn't know this guy existed, man. I didn't know this guy existed because many and I have been looking for a DM, but there wasn't really a proper DM available. Um, the only one we, we it looked like we, we were going to get if things went all right was Declan Rice, but Hajid Mill, that was never going to happen, especially after we signed Ronaldo, Verani, Sancho. Um, but yeah, this guy, we should have, I don't know why we're not linked with him, man. He should literally be perfect for Man United. Absolutely perfect, bro. He really, really would, man. Really, really would. Um, and I saw a comment in the comments down below saying he will easily start for teams like PSG, um, Juventus and that kind of stuff there. Yeah, he probably would, bro. He probably would. He probably would because I think PSG do need a player like this in their midfield, bro. Um, they, they need, PSG need more players like this. But anyways, bro, yeah, I'd love to see this guy in the Premier League. I'd love to see Man United maybe sign him. We're probably not gonna end up signing. I'm just gonna quickly check how old he is, bro. Hold on, he is 27 years old. Yeah, he's 100%. If you go and buy him, bro, it's probably gonna be worth 30 mil. Man United January, you might have to go in, bro. I take the risk on him, bro. He looks like an unbelievable tackle on the wall. He really does. He looks strong as well. He was still the Premier League, man. Man United, bring him in, bring him in. But anyways, man, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like, button, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. Peace.